Most people have heard this festival from the viral video of the 2012 After Movie, which got a billion views. Tomorrowland is one of the biggest electric music festivals held in the world. And if you haven't heard of it, you probably didn't have the internet in 2012. It used to be organized by a joint venture by the original founders together with IDNT. Now it's, uh, it's its own entity and Tomorrowland's organizers are predominantly concentrating on the one festival going around the world. The original festival takes place in Boom, 20, 32 kilometers north of Brussels and it's been going since 2005. Tomorrowland has since become the most noble global music festival. It has won the International Dance Music Awards Best Music Event five years in a row from 2012 to 2016. The 18 years and older event goes for three days, mid-July, and on average, it has the attendance of 180,000 people, and has kept that number for six years. Though, in 2014, they held the event over two weekends, and there were over 360,000 people. That is an epic music festival. You see, the year before, in 2013, Tickets sold out in one second, while the full madness tickets, which is the three-day pass, took 35 minutes to sell out. It was logged that there was two million people waiting to buy tickets that day. They broke records and servers. And you wonder why Tomorrowland is so good? Since the second one in 2006, it has held names like Paul Van Dyke, Swiss House Mafia, Avicii, David Guetta, Tiesto, Afrojack, Hardwell, Steve Aoki, Faithless, and Above and Beyond. Just to name a few of the headliners, these guys do not fuck around with getting the biggest na names in dance to come to their playground and shake Tomorrowland speakers. All day for three days with countless megastars, you can dance like a festival goddess. or a fucking chicken for all I care. You can stay at the festival for a couple days if you wish in the Dreamville, which is what they call the camping grounds. You can take your own camping gear or you can buy a pre-made ticket and get the peasants to do all the work. There are multiple levels of accommodation there's the Magnificent Grounds, which is the DIY section, pretty much a refugee camp for the, uh, with music. There's the Friendship Ground, ideal for groups of your mates. And then there's the Middle Class with the Easy Tents, the tents that are made by the peasants before you get there. Or if you're a semi-pedantic and you like something of class, you have the Cabanas for two. Don't even think about it, just admire from the fence where the celebrities or the well-established models or fucking something party around the mansions. It's for 12 people and rumors say that it will slog you $50,000 Australian for the five days. And besides the fact that there's tents and accommodation, the organizers have given the Tomorrowland music-loving intoxicated rabbits a place to bump uglies in the Church of Love. The attention to detail of the festival, IDNT put towards the decorations and the ticketing, the costumes, uh, the customer care is immaculate. To make you feel as soon as you step inside, you walk into a fairy tale imagination and you can just feel the magic. IDNT put a lot of work into the into their decorations. One of the rules are if you deal with any of the Tomorrowland decorations, you will be removed from the festival. It's not just Germany, but it's everywhere. There's an American spin-off called the Tomorrow World. For some reason, it didn't happen in 2016, but as well as Brazil have their Tomorrowland shindig for themselves, both having a strong number with 140 to 180,000 people going and injecting 
close to $30 million into the local communities. There are many other countries putting their hands up to host a Tomorrowland in their backyard. So there might be one coming to you. But if you miss this Tomorrowland, get on your social media, find out when the tickets are on sale. Remember, it sells out in seconds. And if you're worried about the flights and travel, they have Global Journey, where they set up everything with packages so everyone in your country or area goes to Tomorrowland at the same time. If you can't buy a ticket to Germany, Brazil or America, or if you just missed out on buying a ticket, Tomorrowland have the festival live streamed to venues all around the world. Mexico, Israel, Japan, Colombia, South Africa and other parts of Germany in the campaign called Unite. And I'll link that below. Look up the dates and log it into your calendar. Thank you for watching guys. Subscribe if you want to know about the biggest festivals around the world weekly. Then go to ddworldfestivals.com if you want to travel and go around the world traveling to all different festivals. I can help you get there. Check out some of the other festivals that I've talked about and maybe it will whet your appetite for some festivals that you want to go to in the future. See you soon guys.